Welcome back to another video, and I'm losing my voice if you can't tell. But know what? I'm grinding this video for you guys because uh, these videos do really well, and I've only posted like 10, maybe 12. And uh, know what? We have we get a lot of views on them. So uh, yeah, call me selfish. I don't care. Call me greedy. I could care less. Um, but uh, yeah, let's get into the video. Please leave a like, subscribe, turn on notifications, because uh, uh, I always post good videos about uh. Stupid My Story Animated, because that's what we're talking about today. So, uh, yeah, if you guys really hate My Story Animated, uh, leave a like, subscribe, uh, and subscribe to the main channel, which hopefully will turn into the second channel. I'm ranting now, so, uh, yeah, let's just bully on My Story Animated. Hey, Ross, toss it up. My brother came home with an F on his physics exam and blamed me for it. He said, My sister was listening to loud music, so I couldn't concentrate and study. I so, uh, basically, all I'm gonna say is boo-hoo. You, you failed, and, uh, because, uh, your sister was playing music too loud, alright? And, uh, what? Are they playing on the goddamn boot of boombox? Uh, so basically, I'm gonna bully both of them here. One, the, to the sister, there's something called goddamn headphones. You can put them in. And I'm not trying to be an ass here, but I'm just pointing out the obvious. You can just put in headphones. And for the brother, there's something called a door, alright? And, uh, I'm not sure if you guys know what a door is. But, uh, you can close it and open it. And, uh, you know what? That's what I do most of the time. So, um, uh, maybe it's just me personally, but... I'm not too big of a fan of uh, My Story Animated and uh, their really dumb, 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 stupid, dumb uh, the, the, the plots, alright? And uh, their excuses are pretty pathetic, too. But know what? Uh, I'm, I'm gonna skip a whole bunch of the video and just get to the part two, because apparently the dad's bad, too. So, uh, yeah. I even put a lock on my door, so I had to send him a WhatsApp message if I needed to go to the bathroom. But I knew the way he treated me wasn't right, so I gathered evidence on my smartphone by recording how he terrorized me. Then, after school, I went to the police and showed them video footage of how I was treated. When they saw that I wasn't allowed to go to the toilet without my dad's permission, they decided to take my dad into custody. And when he got trialed the next week, the judge called him a monster and sentenced him to eight months in prison. So many problems with this. So, uh, basically, what you're saying is you didn't get a drink, you didn't get food, you didn't get water. You had you only text your dad to go to the bathroom, and uh, pretty much he gets arrested. Uh, literally gets caught. EDP. No, not. No, I'm, I'm joking. Relax. Um, but he literally gets caught because he wouldn't let you use the bathroom. All right. And uh, you had to text him. I know this is pretty bad. Uh, but I'm gonna still make fun of it because it needs to be made fun of. He lets you go to school. So. Basically, your dad is so stupid, but he's a millionaire. He's just that stupid, but, 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 he's going to let you go to school and have an opportunity to tell the police. I don't really see the point of that, but know what? That's just me. Uh, if he was that smart, wouldn't he be able, or wouldn't he see your iPhone? Literally, you're just holding it at him. Holding it at him. I honestly don't understand how he could not see that, but know what? Maybe I'm just the blind one here. The girl was half naked and said, Oh my god, this is so embarrassing! She tried to stand up, but my brother said, I don't want to stop. And then he continued kissing her. I said, That's not how you treat a girl. If she wants to stop, you have to let her go. That's when my brother stood up and came over to me. He pushed me against the wall and said, You don't tell me what to do. Better be careful before I'll slap that arrogance out of your face. That's when his girlfriend pushed him from behind and said, Let her go! She didn't do anything! My brother got seriously angry, turned around and screamed, Shut up! Then he pushed her back more and more. I really thought he was going to hurt her, so I jumped on his back and screamed, Leave her alone! But he just took my hand and twisted it so hard that I started screaming out of pain. He said, You cry like a little girl. And that's when I had enough and bit right into his neck. 
What happened next is too graphic and violent to show on YouTube, but my brother had to go to the hospital because I had bitten through some important vein, and he almost died of blood loss. Honestly, there's a lot to, uh, to comprehend here. Alright, so basically, um, she walks in, she literally caught this man in 4K, uh, and this, I'm actually serious now, this man got EDP'd, caught in 4K, uh, like, 4K caught, alright boys, and, uh, know what, GG Gamer, um, and apparently, the sister has strong enough goddamn teeth, biting his, his neck, alright, and, like, breaks a vein, he almost died. But yet, if and, and she was crying. But yet, the brother does not press charges, even though they hate each other. All right, I, I'm not sure about you guys. Maybe it's just me. But I would be petty enough if my sibling wanted to almost kill me. I'm not sure about you guys, but I'm that petty. I probably uh, I'm gonna press charges against you. But uh, honestly, that's not a that, that's not a, her choice because I, I think she's underage. So her mom probably didn't let him press charges, but I'm just saying, uh, where the hell, where, where the hell were the parents at in this situation? The stepdad and the mom? Nah, nah, screw that, we don't need that. And when she saw me wearing a short summer dress and lots of makeup, she immediately knew what I was up to. She said, so you are my boyfriend's project partner? I responded, <laughs> yeah, I am. She leaned over the table and said, do you always dress like this? I blushed, but didn't respond. Then David said, Don't worry, she always dresses like a hoe. So, uh, Noah, I think I'm gonna wrap up the video here, but, uh, for the last clip, all I'm saying is, um, if someone called me a hoe, I'm not too sure if I wanted to date them. But then again, I'm not a girl. So, uh, maybe people are into that stuff. But, I, I, I have no idea. This, this is just proof that, uh, my story animated is, uh, completely fake, uh, but yeah, boys, that's gonna end the video here, thank you guys for watching, it, this was a little bit of a longer one, so, uh, yeah, I'm losing my voice, there's a lot of, there was a, there was a lot of voice cracks in here, but know what, GG's, alright, so leave a like, subscribe, turn on notifications, and, uh, yeah, let's get this video to, uh, uh, I, I don't know, a lot of views, cause, uh, views make me feel good. And, uh, yeah, in all seriousness, thank you guys for watching. I really do appreciate it. Uh, and uh, if you guys do like the reaction channel, then uh, I kind of want this to blow up. So, uh, yeah, thank you guys. Hey, Ross, toss it up. Pull up in a right, yeah, you painted with some decals. I ain't never stopped, can't be trusted in any female. Got a shorty blog, had a testing through the email. Talking about a pop, I won't fall, that's a detail.